Hi, my name is Mrs. Masha Atirza and I am part of the BTEC Applied Science team. I'm going to spend a little bit of time talking you through about the course and just um, giving you an idea of what's involved in the course and why you might want to apply for it in sixth form. So, why choose BTEC Applied Science? If you have really enjoyed science at GCSE um, or you are hoping to pursue a career in something that is science related, then BTEC Applied Science would be really good for you. Um, one of the best things about BTEC Applied Science is that you get to do all three areas of science, so biology, chemistry and physics. You also get to do lots of practicals and there is opportunity to go off site and um, go on trips as well. So what type of activities will you carry out in applied science? So we do, as I said earlier, we do lots of um, practicals. Some of these practicals include titrations, preparing standard solutions, calibrating equipment, doing chromatography, using the microscopes um, and analysing lots of different substances. So every time you do a practical, you will usually have to plan that practical and then write that practical up and analyse the results. And that will form part of the coursework um, because one of the units that you will do will be coursework based. So moving on um, and thinking about what's involved, it's not an easy option, applied science. It can be challenging at times. There is assessment um, elements to it. So you will have to do an exam and you also have coursework elements as well. I'll talk to you a little bit more about how the course is structured on the next slide. But some people might think it's an easy option. It really isn't an easy option. But if you are somebody who isn't always great at just sitting the exam, um, the coursework can help you just get that higher grade if you're somebody that's good at coursework and not always fantastic at sitting the exams, providing that you pass the exam, um, then the coursework elements can help you move that pass up to a merit, um, etc. So it's looking that you, your final grade will be based on your exams and your courseworks together and that will give you your final grade. Um, so students often succeed on this course. I think, um, you know, it's a course that we traditionally do really well with and students do offer, often um, succeed and achieve or, or exceed their target grades. And there's lots of supported teachers um, in the BTEC Applied Science team to help you. So what's involved then? So just to give you a little bit more of an idea about how the um, course is broken down. Within the BTEC, there are four units that you're going to study. In year 12, you'll study unit one, which is the key principles of science. And this is where you will study about biology, chemistry and physics. Um, and you will have three half hour exams on each of those areas. Um, you have to pass the unit one exam to continue with the course, but that's not usually a problem. And I'm sure if you meet the entry requirements, which I will talk about later, there's no reason why you wouldn't pass that exam. Um, unit two then is four different practicals that you will have to take part, um, you'll have to plan, you'll have to carry out and then write up and analyse the results at the end. Um, so that's a coursework based unit is unit two. And then in year 13, you will do unit three, which is all about your scientific skills. So we will prepare you for a practical exam. And in this practical exam, um, you will have to carry out a practical that's given to you by the exam board and you'll do that under exam conditions um, and then you'll gain some results. You'll then do one, an hour and a half written exam based on those results. Um, and unit 12 is a research unit. So this is another coursework unit that you'll do in year 13 and it's made up of four part assignments. Um, and for each assignment, you will have to research. Um, it's about pathogens and diseases. So you'll research about some different pathogens and diseases that your teacher will tell you about. Um, you'll have some lessons about them as well. So you'll know what kind of thing to research. And then um, you'll give those in and you'll either get a pass, a merit or a distinction in those things. If for whatever reason you didn't pass an area of the coursework, there is opportunity for you to resubmit that coursework um, once your teacher's given you a little bit of feedback on it. So entry requirements. Um, 
To get into applied science, you need to get a four in English, a four in maths, and you also need to get a four four in GCSE combined science. Frequently asked questions. A lot of the time people ask us, is it the same as an A-level? Well, there's lots of aspects of the course that are um, similar to A-level and some of the specification of A-level chemistry, biology and physics overlaps. Um, but actually in VTech, you get to do a lot more independent research and there's um, possibly more practicals in there as well. Is it recognised by universities? Yes, the answer is definitely yes. The course is recognised by lots of universities and you can get lots of UCAS points from doing BTEC Applied Science. The better grade you get, the more UCAS points you'll receive. Um, and then those UCAS points can be used towards different courses um, and to get you into university. So career opportunities, um, there's lots of different um, degrees that my previous students have applied to, but some of them I've just listed on this slide. So nursing degrees, midwifery, sports science, business degrees, computer science degrees and radiography degrees are just some that I can remember off the top of my head from the previous two years that some of my students have applied for. So completing the applied science course has given them UCAS points that they have put together along with the other A-level subjects um, or BTEC subjects that they are doing and they've got them into those universities to do those courses. So it's definitely um, something that universities recognise and something that can help you progress um, if you want to go to university. So we really look forward to teaching you in September 21 and um, really hope that you decide to take up um, the offer of um, doing BTEC science and best wishes. <laughs>